everyone, my name is Quack, and today there was a really happy day. Today is winter. Do you ready? So today, let's get ready for the winter. I love winter. Didn't you? How about you? Do you like winters? I do like the little <coughs> winter snow globes. And at winter, I could do many fun things. I could go. I can drink hot chocolate with a marshmallow on top. I could get presents from from Santa. Hmm. And I could wear my favorite sweater. Sometimes I can wear it to you. Hmm. And I could build snowman, but at here, if you were in America or somewhere else, you can got snow. But at here, I am Vietnamese, so I don't got any snow yet. So never mind. I can craft a snowman and play with it. And I could got snow fight. And here I don't have snow fight, so I use paper fight instead. <laughs> I just use paper, roll it into a ball, squeeze it to so get smaller, and then fast as I get, we need to get shields by cardboard, and then we quickly throw the snowball. I mean paper balls into each other and we also need a helmet that is the that is where we're gonna throw to if someone throw into your helmet that means you lose you need to get out of the game kind of like that i want i wonder if i got enough paper and now I gotta teach you something. I I I gonna teach you how to make a little paper snowman to craft it. I think at the snow when snow it got kind of easier, you know. I think you probably know how to do it. Need some snow, roll it into a snowball first. Roll it and roll it into a big ball for a body and roll another snowball. Roll it and roll it in snow until it it big it need to be smaller than the body to be a head. Haven't you ever seen it a people's re head is even bigger than the body? Ugh that ridiculous. Nobody can do that. It just got the body can be bigger than the head, but no one will get a head bigger than the body. That funny. And and then you you use some pebbles to make the eyes and mouth. Put on a carrot and put on. Hmm, Put on any hat you want. Use some stick for the hand. Take take a scarf, any scarf you wanted. Roll it around. Use some pebbles to make the buttons. Kind of easy like that. But when you're crafting a a tiny paper snowman, I mean a small paper snowman, it will be smaller. So you gonna need some paper, mm, some paper, and then roll it into a ball. I mean, a ball. Mm, kind of like for the, for the body. You can do it small like this snowman I has designed and on my board. You can roll it as the body. And then another paper, you need to roll it smaller, or you could just cut half of paper and roll it in 
make it a smaller ball. And then like that. And for and then you can use some glue to stick those heads or or when you put the head on, decorate everything and then and then the head will fall off. Sometimes it needs to be stick to each other. So you will need tape or glue. I think you probably need to use glue for this. And for the hat. Hmm, hat, huh? You could design paper hats. Hmm, is it to be? Or you could use some cloth and then sew it into the hat. Or if not, never mind. Just use a small piece of cloth, throw and make it into a circle. Hmm, sew it together to make it a proper circle. And then sew on the top, up down, up down at the top, and then pull it. It, the top will be hmm, smaller and smaller, and then it's, and then it make it into tiny circle. You would not very seen it, and then you need to take a knot up here, so it will be keeping the top, the top to be the small hole, and then you could decorate the hat, put it on the snowman, and then done. For the nose, hmm, you could use a tiny triangle shape and stick it on here, or you can use a paper comb. Hmm, cut out a, a small piece of paper, roll it into a comb, glue it, and then glue it onto the nose. For the eyes, you can use paper also. This is a craft thing. I'm I most like to craft with papers or cloths. So the eyes and mouth that we could use paper. First draw draw the eyes on here. I draw the eyes is closed. So I draw the eyes closed, cut it out, and then stick to it the snowman. As for buttons, you can use real buttons. Stick it on the snowman. For the hand, maybe I could use some small sticks, or I could even use twigs. I need to I need to bend it to make smaller sticks. And then I stick it on here, stick it on here. And for the scarf, I use a useless piece of cloth. That must be the shape of it, rectangle. And I need to get the cloth. It won't be, it won't, would not be, flat and it should be fuzzy a little bit so it will be kind of kind of fluffy like this one it's kind of ugly but mm, you can use any of it wrap around the snowman and you got a, a small paper snowman and and but i'm gonna teach you about how to make delicious, delicious hot chocolate. I think you know how to do it, but you need to be careful at the part melting. And then first, you can use some milk chocolate or dark chocolate. Dark chocolate, a little, a little bitter, so I do not very want to use hot chocolate. I would be, it would be better if I use milk chocolate. It would be sweeter. I put it into a, a bowl, a bowl or a mug, 
and then I put it in these my profile. I put it in here. I gonna put it some minutes, some minute, and then I I will wait until it melted into a liquid. And do not drink it. We need some marshmallow to decorate. You could build some marshmallow into a small snowman to put in here. First, you need three, three of them. Use a bread, small bread or stick, just long as most pretty marshmallows. And push those marshmallow into a stick. So you got the snowman's body. You could use a, a special marker that you could eat. Or if not, you could use some some small candies that got different colors. Stick for the eyes, stick for the mouth, and for the buttons. For the scarf, mm, kind of hard so you could skip. For the hand, use two pretzel stick, but you need to bend it to make it shorter. Push it into the body that could be stick. And then you, with your marshmallow snowman is ready. Put it in the hot chocolate and it marshmallow is slowly melted. It'd be really relaxed and yummy. I think you enjoy the winter. Sometime I promise you to to doing the get ready for the spring and summer and also fall. It will be fun to do all of these. First I I say what can you do? And then what would it what would it have? And the last thing is to do it. Have fun in the winter. Bye!